Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Brianna and you can call me Brie and today we are going shopping. I haven't been shopping in so long, like actually shopping in so long. So I'm so excited. I'm going to be shopping for a mini trip I'm going on to Pismo Beach. So I need to get bathing suits, jewelry, sandals, all that fun stuff. I don't know what I'll actually get, like it may not be too much, but we'll see. So I'm gonna go shopping for that and then I'll give you a little haul at the end of what I got. Before we go, I'll show you my outfit and whatnot cause it's cute or whatever. I have this plain white tank from Cotton On. This really long skirt that goes almost down to my ankle from Paxson, I believe. I have flip flops and a little anklet for my friend. My classic jewelry I always have, which I'm gonna try to get more of because I'm so tired of ones I have. And then I just did my hair with little braids and look at the back. And the bow, I love. So we're gonna get going and let's see what we can find. First stop, Old Navy. I don't know what we're gonna find here. Maybe bathing suits? There's a cute little like workout set. Let me show, right over there. We'll see. This is Aerie and American right now. I got these so far to look at bathing suits and some pants. Oh my god, the lighting is really weird. I definitely pressed something weird on my camera. Oh my god, this filter is weird. Hold on. Okay, and we are back from shopping. As you saw, I didn't get too much, but that is mainly because I am preparing for our little mini vacation, which I'll most likely be wearing these things. So I'll give you a quick little haul of what I got, and then we're gonna pack up everything. So first I'll do this little bag because it's separate. <laughs> it's this cute little bag from La Visa, which I'm definitely gonna be keeping, but I got some rings. They're just silver rings. Like in the stores, they only have gold things. I'm like, I'm a silver girly, so I need silver. And also my fingers are so small. Like I have this one ring that's like completely tarnished and gross, probably from Claire's too, but it's the only one that fits from a pack that's like maybe a size six or five and they still don't fit me. This is the only one that fits. So these are like super itty bitty, if you can tell. And so I'm gonna try these and I hope they fit. I think they will. Speaking of jewelry, I went to Claire's, classic, cause why not? And they always have like crazy deals. I couldn't really find rings that fit, but I did find some chunky-ish earrings. So here are those. They're just like silver, kind of a little chunky hoops that I'll switch out for the ones I'm wearing cause I've been wearing these for so long. Okay, sounds a little bit less cray cray. But then let's move on to the actual clothes, which I got all from American Eagle and Aerie. So I first got these leggings, which are not on the list to get, but they had a sale, it was like 40% off. Low key, my mom convinced me, but they're this bright, like corally pink. They're so cute. This is my first Aerie legging that doesn't have the crisscross, but they're still super high-waisted. Super cute, super up my alley. I'll definitely be wearing these like all the time. And then I said I wanted a couple bathing suits or at least one to wear to our trip because we're gonna go to the beach at least once, I think. And so I got this pink one. I can't do a try on for this, but it's this pink little top, pretty basic, but it does have a gold hoop. Like I said, everything's gold, but I don't mind the gold being in this. And I just got these normal bottoms. They're kind of like high-waisted still. I can put these like above my hips. And then last, but definitely not least, I actually found sandals, which I didn't expect. So I have flip-flops as you probably saw me wearing already, but I wanted sandals that were like more dressy. Like if I wasn't going to the beach, I can just walk around in them. And then these cool platform ones, this is from American Eagle specifically. And they're just like a beige tan, kind of like crisscross one, but they're super platform. And if you don't know, I am 5'2", five, 5'3", five, super short, so love these and it's not necessarily a heel so it shouldn't like hurt my feet too much which is the goal <laughs> so that's my mini haul i'm gonna pack everything up and next thing you know we'll be in pismo okay it is time to pack now it is wednesday and we are leaving tomorrow on thursday 
and I need to get my stuff packed. Now that I'm like, how do I say this? I feel like I'm more into like what I wear and like doing my hair and stuff that this made it a little bit more difficult because I want to bring like all these accessories to do my hair and have cute outfits and all this stuff. So I'm going to show you all my outfits I have laid out and I'm going to put them in this bag. This looks really crazy on camera, but it's like a pink duffel bag and this room put all my stuff. I think this may change because I have two other siblings. We may switch around things, but that's what I'm thinking of doing for now. So I'm going to first show you all my outfits in order of what I'm wearing. So the first day, which is tomorrow, we are going to go drive down there and go to the street market. They have like a little street market there. So it's going to be more towards the evening time. So I'm going to be wearing jeans and a pink tank top. If you see a theme of pink, um, yeah, that is kind of the theme. <laughs> but just cute little pink tank top, pretty simple. And then if it's a little chilly, I'm going to wear my little shrug jacket over top. And then I want to wear a bow in my hair. So I brought actually two ribbon because I'll show you later. But I'm going to wear one of the ribbon in my hair because I think I'm going to curl it and like do it before we leave since we're not leaving till at least like halfway through the day. Hopefully I can do that before we leave. So I'll probably put the other ribbon in like my toiletries or makeup bag later, but I have to figure out all that tomorrow. The second day we are going to the beach. So I'll be wearing my new bathing suit, which you just saw, this cute little pink one. And adding on to the theme, <laughs> I have this pink tank top and then just some jean shorts. After that, we're gonna come back and shower and then we're gonna go to a little little picnic park concert song thing. So we're gonna be sitting on the grass. And for that, I'm gonna choose something pretty comfy. So I also have what you just saw, my new leggings, which are super bright pink, super fun vibes. And then I have this off-white pink tank top that I'm gonna wear with it. And since it might be a little cold at that time because it is by the beach, I'm just be wearing this white actual jacket. And then the last day is kind of up to what we want to do. So we may go to the beach again. And if we do, I just brought a different top because I didn't really want to bring a whole nother bathing suit since I'm kind of sick of the bathing suits I have right now. So I just have this green top, which I'll just put with the pink bottoms, kind of watermelon vibes. As a beach cover up or just to wear if we don't go to the beach, I have this tropical tank top and fuzzy shorts which i probably should wear jean shorts because that's more of like the vacation vibe but i'm gonna be real i'm gonna be on my period this whole time and my white shorts that are really cute i don't really want to wear i know these are white too but they're more comfy and maybe i'll be more confident in them but yeah this is a pretty comfy but like cute-ish outfit and then later that night, we're gonna go to dinner somewhere and it's nothing fancy or anything, but I like to dress up. So I have this cute little pink dress that I've never worn before. It was supposed to be for my birthday party, but it just didn't turn out how I liked it and I ended up not returning it. So it's a super cute pink dress. I'll most likely wear a bow with this too. And I forgot, um, the two ribbons like the two ribbons I showed earlier. I want to wear with my pink beach outfit, like two pigtails with braids and bows. I know, kind of crazy, but I think it's cute. <laughs> and then the last day we are just coming home. So I'm wearing something super comfy, just some comfy gray shorts and this pink tank top. And then lastly, I have my pajamas, which are just some pajama shorts, and a random soccer shirt that I'm gonna wear to bed. <laughs> and then we have shoes, let me show you. I have my platform Converse, which I'm gonna wear tomorrow to the street market, to the sitting at the park thing, because those pants are really long and I need platform shoes for them. And then maybe if we don't go to the beach on Saturday, I have normal flip-flops, obviously just for the beach or any days I don't feel like wearing socks and shoes. And lastly, just as you saw in my haul, 
my platform shoes and I was trying them on and they're kind of scary to walk in because they're so tall because I'm not used to it. So I wanted to wear them tomorrow, but it might be a lot of walking. So I'm just going to wear these with that dress for dinner. So it's like not too much walking, but still really cute. And that is all for the clothes. So I need to pack everything up in this bag. Okay, so I just put that all in the duffel bag. And now I need to think about toiletries, makeup, and just extra stuff. So this is my makeup bag. I have all the normal stuff I already have in it. I just added some perfume and some lotion. And then I decided I'm gonna add just one of the ribbons in here since I don't wanna forget it. And I think I'm gonna put that in this pink duffel bag, the one I used to use for school. I'm thinking that's gonna go in there with like some of my towels and blankets because I have this washcloth towel for my face, this towel for showering, and then my beach towel. So hopefully that fits in here. I'm not entirely sure yet. We may work that out differently with my family, but we'll have to see. And then besides a few other like little things I'm gonna get tomorrow, or things I haven't decided, like if I'm gonna bring a curling iron or not. I don't know. <laughs> but I do have a little electronics bag, just this little bag. I have this battery charger for my camera that I like to take pictures with. And then this charger for this current camera I'm filming on. And then I'll add my phone charger, maybe headphones, whatever else in here tomorrow. Oh my gosh, I almost forgot. I wanted to show you what I'm bringing for my purse. So I'm bringing this beautiful Kate Spade bag, which is my only um, really nice bag. I got it for my eighth grade graduation. But it's this cute little bag with a chain, which is kind of loud, so don't mind that. But inside, besides like all my cameras, my phone, wallet, all that stuff, that would be in here. But I also have gum chapstick, Advil because, you know, how it be, my sunglasses, which I don't know, I look kind of crazy with sunglasses on, that's why I never wear them, and this little elf lipstick from my bestie, thank you so much, I love it, like I literally use it all the time, so that's why I want to keep it in my purse and not my makeup bag so I can like reapply, but yeah, these are the goodies of this bag, but yeah, super cute, yeah, that is pretty much it. Oh, and I also have a blanket. It's that blue one over there because I don't want to take like this nice white one <laughs> or my gray one that's also over there. So I'm just taking that really bright teal one. <laughs> but that is going to be it for this video. I'm so excited to share with you the video that will come up next, which is the actual trip vlog. So that is starting tomorrow and... Hopefully I can get some fun content for you guys since I don't normally go on trips. <laughs> but yeah, that is it for this video. Let me know in the comments if there's any more summer type of videos you would like to see. I'll see you guys very soon and I hope you're having an amazing day. Mwah, bye guys!